Welcome to the next episode of the Skipper Key Puppies, the second and third months of their training and development. We still weigh them, but not once to each day, but we weigh them once a week. Here, of course, we're not weighing two at once, but they're having fun playing and tobogganing. You will see a big development, a change, a big change in the puppies from this stage where they're just barely kind of wiggling around, not really able to walk very well, to the end of the month when they'll be really getting training, they'll be obedient to many things, and much more aware and well developed. Here you see they're just getting aware of each other. Starting to play a little bit and show some dominance behavior. Who's going to be the top dog of the group? They're also now getting ready to be weaned. Not so much dependence on mom, they're eating kind of mushy puppy food and by the end of the month they should be eating completely dry puppy food and mostly be weaned off their mom and Zana will be very happy and relieved because they got kind of little sharp teeth now. Mom says, oh, I think their food tastes pretty good. Taste testing. And there they said, okay, now we'll get back on the milk truck. We'll also start giving them chew toys so they can play with their new teeth. And also give them something to do and not destruct everything else that you don't want them to chew on. Now one thing at this stage, they're very curious. Yeah, at this stage we can train them old. already for certain behaviors and what we call border training. So you see they're at the doorway, they're being tempted by mom and dad who are playing. They want to come inside but we gave them a little pinch on the neck whenever they tried to come over. Just a small pinch like the mom would give them when she's biting them to correct them. And ever after that, twice, and then they never had to be re-corrected. These are the two boys, Jimmy and his dad. Okay, so we see baby as one ear up. Baby, baby, hey, good girl. Yeah, good girl. And since skipper keys are Belgian barge dogs and you and water dogs we're getting them used to the water early here they are having their first swim bath and you see that doesn't bother them to be in the water they are having a good time whoop After the bath, they're all dry and clean, and all oh, they feel so good. The cute puppies. The cute puppies. And we start taking them up on the deck, on the outside deck. Sana playing with her puppy. We have a towel in case there's little accidents and a pad. And they start getting more exercise, playing, interacting with their mom and dad. Nera, she's challenging Zotka. You see already what a difference that they, at this stage, they're whoop, running pretty well. They're getting their ears up. One baby has her ears up. There's a correction. There she is chewing on something she shouldn't. Do you give a pinch on the neck? Up. Oh, no. 
they start to chew, they can chew a little bit, but if they get too tough, correct. And there's baby practicing on her little pee pee carpet. There, good girl. She's doing her peeing on her carpet. I give her praise. Now they're much more coordinated. They play with toys. <laughs> Put some it's tennis balls up so that they could play. <laughs> Swing the ball. Who's tough? Who's the who's the baddest? And of course we gotta record what's happening. There they are. Right. A nice film of them playing with the tennis balls. nice scenery in the background if you're lucky enough to live on a boat and be in a beautiful bay. <laughs> Here I'm training them a little bit. Come when I call, come. Come, come, come. And you see mom and dad. Zlatka there. Zana. There's one puppy. She's not sure. Okay, now I give them a big bone. This is their first giant bone, beef bone. Nera and Baby are having a great time with it. And there Jimmy timidly sneaks in because sometimes he gets beat up by the other dominant girls. Here we're teaching some border training again. You see on the right, right where the dog is sniffing. You're not supposed to cross that area. Whoop! There's a correction. No! You just give a little pinch on the neck and say no! And very rapidly, it only took a couple times that mom and dad, they can play on the deck and they know they can stay on that section of the deck, but if mom and dad run off, they're not supposed to follow. There you see, mom and dad are on the fore deck, the forbidden deck, and baby doesn't go down there. Jimmy is looking, but they won't. They've got two corrections, and now they will not pass that point on the deck, even though they can easily walk down there. And it's very important to do it very early, so it's ingrained. a great time to train the puppies because they are impressionable enough that if you make a small correction then it really sinks in. Afterwards they start to get more independent and more and skipper keys are headstrong and they like to do what they like to do so it's good to start them out very early with the corrections and training. Don't just let them jump all over you if you're going to give them food make them sit Here they are, I'm telling them, all oh, follow me, follow me, come this way, come this way. Okay, they learn to come and come with me, yes, and they must all come, otherwise you correct them. Each time, and sit. Right. Sit. Get some food for the one who sits. And the others get the idea quickly. And then afterwards, you give them some playtime. If they did really well, they get to have fun. Okay, now we're learning another trick. This is called stay pillow. You see the one puppy that's on a pillow, they have to stay. And even though there's distraction and now the other one's playing all around, they have to stay on that pillow. If they don't, you give them the little pinch on the neck correction. And you see, amazingly, all the other dogs are distracting, but that dog puppy stays on the pillow, and you do it with each one. Here again, follow me, let's go, let's go. Let's go this way. Okay, mom and dad are getting in the, in the fun too. Let's 
go this way, let's go this way. Okay, let's go this way. And here I'm using a method that I learned is called the perfect dog by Don Sullivan. And it's a very nice training. He has a nice training DVD. And some very effective methods. There she's learning to stay. Sit and stay. There she goes. Stay. Okay. Come. Stay. Good baby. And even when for every activity after they've learned a skill, practice it whenever you can, like when it's feeding time, instead of having them jump all over you like crazy and nuts. They have to sit and behave, not jump on the food. You wait, they wait, they learn to wait while you put all the dishes down and then you give the signal. And then they eat very nicely. They used to scatter it everywhere. There's a little bit of scattering, but now they eat very nicely. And here they are. Waiting on the foredeck. Here they're learning the pillow. Stay on the pillow. Each one has to stay on his or her pillow. Down. Down. That's it. There, you see? They each have their little pillow they need to stay. Dad is watching. He's practicing too. Okay, down. Yes, good girl. Okay, come. It. Good guys, good guys. And now, for a reward, they get to go on their first beach expedition. This is the first time they go to the beach. Mom and Dad are going to be kind of tied off on the side, and the little guys are learning to follow. Follow on the leash without running away. And play in the water, that way they can go from shallow water easily and have fun. Okay, afterwards, for the reward, they get to play a little bit without the leash. As long as they obey each time when you call them again, they have to come. And they're Jimmy, swimming. Oh, this is so fun. I think I'm going to go round and round. This is fun. Skipper keys enjoy the water. There we go. Good night to Jackie. We have Nara and Baby coming back from the swim in open water back to the beach. And Zotka, the dad, he loves water so much, he'll just swim for hours. We're taking a movie. So for a final, we go here taking pictures. We gotta line up for a photo. Line up, line up! 